He's got a knife. I see it. Right here. This video from Clinton Township Police shows their arrest of 36-year-old Brian Benjamin after a call for help from a Mifflin Township officer hurt in the line of duty. He's in pretty bad shape with a bunch of head trauma. I hope he recovers good. hope he gets better. And, you know, officers shouldn't be put in that kind of danger. Mark Hodge lives on the corner of Purdue and Mecca. He says he and another neighbor were trying to help Benjamin jump his car, but there were a lot of red flags during their interaction. He wasn't nice at all. He wasn't polite at all. He just he was a weird guy like he was on something. Hodge called police after he says Benjamin got physical with him. He pushed me once, you know, it's good. Then he come up and smacked my hand. The Fraternal Order of Police describes what responding officers found oh, when they is. arrived. These officers are showing up and they're seeing one of their brothers bleeding severely. FOP President Jeff Simpson says Benjamin stabbed the officer several times in the head and face with a homemade knife. We dug into Benjamin's past. In 2014, he pled guilty to assaulting an officer in Richland County. And just two years ago, Franklin County court documents show he was violent toward Columbus police, kicking at them and damaging their cruiser. But records show the charges were dismissed in this case because of mental incompetence. Somebody else could get, probably got hurt. After seeing the news Monday morning, Hodge says he's praying for the officer injured, but he's grateful he responded to protect his neighborhood. It made me nervous. I did get in a, you know, hit him and hit him and shouldn't he got up with that knife and stabbed him.